All right, welcome back. So last we left off, we were exploring one of the dungeons, the Firetop Mountain. Let's see, so now we got to kind of come back and forth for this puzzle. Let's go do that. Let's see. Left, right, left, right. I'm gonna go see what's on the other side before I do anything. Let's see. Yeah, lately I've been playing Breath of the Wild and I've been dying a lot more than I expected. It's hard because it's like I just got one extra heart, but then it's, I don't know, it'll take time, I guess. Look, Sky. The, the mega rock floor blocks the volcano mouth. Looks safe, but it's enormous rock floating in lava. It rises and falls with the magma underneath. Maybe you control the mag could control the magma flow. That'll be fun. Okay, go see what's going on down here. And just imagine how hot it would be. I don't know, like, certain natural things like this are, like, just scary stuff. Because it's like, you never know when it's gonna just go. <laughs> Let's see what's going on. Let's see, where am I going? Oh, I'm just kind of wandering around, seeing what I can find. Mm. I'm gonna go back and see if I can go the other way. Any other way? I miss a chest, which is a trap. I forgot that there was mimics in this game. Let's see, let's just go up and up and see what we can get to. Because I'm not sure otherwise. Hmm. Okay. Seems like there's a lot of setting up to do in this puzzle. I guess I'll find out. Oh! I think when you had the ice one, you could freeze these things. Ooh, what did that do? Oh, it raised the lava level. Sky. The mega rock floor is ri has begun rising. You can raise or lower the level of vault the volcano. Okay, then. Oh no! It's a close one, I almost died there. Let's see what I got. Okay, so now I guess I go all the way back down. Or see if I can get around. Oh yeah, I can probably get around now. I still have to go down. I probably have to go outside the mountain and get stuff. I don't know. Oh, that's it. The mimic respawned. I was wondering why that chest got back. I'm like, what, what's that chest doing here? <laughs> See you guys later. Okay. Somehow we have to get over there. 
We'll just keep going around. Let's see. Ouch. Yeah, for um, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, I'm wondering what it's going to look like um, if they have chickens and if you have like the angry cuckoos. Okay. I don't know how you pronounce that. This, oh, it connects it, so that way it's easier to get through. Health. Oh yeah, that's right. Those things you can use to turn solar energy into health. And you can get burned on the edge, so you have to be careful. Hmm. All right, this is Firetop Mountain. Sky, these are the original golems, an ancient golem. The original golems, the ancient race of giants. The remnant, the remains of the iron giant master who mastered fire. Their majesty endures, protect, endures, protected through the, the ages by the mega rock. So, but that is the boss, I thought. I guess I have to go do stuff first. Have to find a way to awaken him. There's the scan grenades, which are helpful. I'm gonna go ahead and use one of these just for fun. See, there is secret things. Oh man, I really can't get to that then. <laughs> Oh, that's what it means. Huh? The Mega Rock of Technobabble. <coughs> Anyways. So a lot of other games I'm planning on playing are like... I want to play Subnautica, but I'm waiting for them to finish it. And then there's like Stardew Valley. Oh, like, I don't know, I might just go through and do some different ones. But I'm wanting to also... Welcome. No thank you. I didn't notice that it was the door. Hmm. But, um... I'm wanting to play like Overwatch and stuff like that, and just do like little single episodes to break the monotony of just the two episodes I'm doing. Problem is, is my internet is garbage, just utter garbage. Today it's taking a lot longer to upload just one video, and it's because we've got Questar. Instead of like CenturyLink, or no, we've got. Like, CenturyLink with Comcast, they're more dependable, but they keep jacking up their prices every few months. But then there's, um... I don't know. I just can't get good internet with Questar, and it's like... They, they just keep dropping their the signal quality or whatever. Well, I might be, I don't know, I might be, like, totally mispronouncing all their names or whatever, mi or mixing up which company was which, but whatever company we got now, um, it's not Cable, it's, well, it's, it's not Comcast, it's the other one, um, CenturyLink. Oh yeah, I think Questor is different. Anyways, I think I just screwed up this puzzle. Um, now I can fix it. But it's the phone line one where, like, the reception is bad, so it's like every 10 minutes it's been dropping out. So I'm just, I thought I'd do a video while I'm waiting for my first video to upload. So. Oh, 
So we need to, okay, we need to get over there. Um. Let's see what's going on. Because we don't want to lose a block. Get up over there. Okay. I think, okay, I think I know, it's gonna take a while, I'm probably doing it a bit of a longer way, but I think I know what I can do. There we go. Yeah, I would love to do like a couple Overwatch videos. I just, I know that I can't guarantee the quality of the stream. Hmm. I can still fix this, I think. I will just have to go with it. I mean, I can't. There's nothing else I can do. Yeah, I can still get there eventually, I think. No, because I'll have to... Oh, bummer. Because I have to be up here, so I need one of these things to be over there, and I messed up the... the card. Sorry, it's been a while since I've done this puzzle, so it's like... I'm trying to remember how to do get this done right. What's this? What? Does it not reset? I think I have to go all the way out and to reset it. There we go. Forgot how many layers there were to this puzzle. Anyway, this one's probably gonna take a while. Push this here so I can cross over. Then one, eight. two. I don't know. I think it's annoying that cable companies and internet companies like. They keep gen like they'll do you a good price for a few months on a quote unquote deal, but then after a while they'll turn around and jack up your price to like ninety dollars, and it's like you have to go in. And when you go in, they the people are paid to argue with you and to refuse, tr like to attempt to refuse you a good deal. And it's like I just don't think businesses should be run like that, but. I don't know. I mean, it's like cell phone companies, they're competitive with each other, so they don't do crap like that. But since there's only like two internet companies, give or take, um, they keep, they have that like, let's see, maybe I'm doing this weird. But you know what I mean? I mean, they, they just sit and like, well, it's either us or them, so we have the better service, but we're going to charge you double or triple. I don't know. It's frustrating. I mean, I, a lot of it, yeah, you pay for what you get, but if I'm, why should I pay more when you guys already agreed for this? Like, if I'm going to be with you, with the internet company for longer, then why should I have to pay more? If I w I'm just going to leave the internet company that I was with because they were treating me like, or they were being dishonest or being like, you know what I mean. 
I guess, I guess it's not dishonest, but it's like, just because, like, if you want to keep your customers, you can't, you can't just yank away the price. Because if you jack up the price after you've had your customers, then it's like they're going to leave you. So it's like, why not just keep them for years longer? Because I've had my phone number for quite a few years. So it's like, why not just leave it be and not sit and, um, like, cut yourself off by preventing yourself from having those customers for longer instead of, like, jacking up the price and then they leave. But I guess the way they make their money is the people who don't leave immediately. I don't know. It's just how it goes, so. Let's see where we go. Okay, so all the switches are off. I need to turn them all on. Okay, now one of the switches is on. It looks like I have to turn... Oh! Huh. Which one? Another game I might play is like Hyper Light Drifter. Just pl oh, I don't know. I have a lot of Steam games. I don't have like a capture card, so I have right now. I'm playing on an emulator, and like other than that, I have Steam games. Just what's available on my computer. Um, later on, I might get a capture card, like I've thought about that, like, if this pans out at all, I'll um, get a capture card, probably get a better mic and some um, studio foam, but we'll just have to see how things go. Let's see. No, I just came from this way. Let's see, I'm just trying to figure out what, how, I don't know, this map kind of doesn't make sense with the space in the room. Only come out from that way. What are you doing here? How foolish, I thought if I just left you, I thought if you, blah, blah, blah. If you had just left when you had the chance, huh, then I shall use your power as Solar Boy for myself. Master Sky, or er, Sky, make your way through the dungeon and come visit me. I have a little game set for up for you. Ha ha ha. Is he the dungeon's immortal? Anyways, we need to get across somehow, Sky. See what this does. It looks like it's a lever to, yeah, raise the magma level. All right, there it is. Huh. So the first switch. Okay. The stepping stones. Oh no no no! Sorry. Didn't mean to do that. I think I have a fast forward button, but it also captures the screen for some reason. Okay. Um. Oh, bummer. I was hoping for that to be. Oh, that was a close one. Didn't realize I was so low on health. And I was hoping that would be a gun frame. I guess they got me there. Oh, the rising sun grenades. Like a solar flare. Oh, and I think you can raise the lava level once more for this room. If I remember right. Let's see. 
Alright, let's keep going. Oh, this is another, um... Another... This is the exit for the Tome of the Immortal. See, there goes the second one. I thought I'd raised that already. Oh, I guess I didn't... I'll have to raise it back up again. And I'll have to remember to come this way to exit. I'm wondering, like, I think last, when I would play on my own, I would just go out the way I came, but that couldn't, wouldn't be helpful. I guess if I had the lava level up, then I could go across here better, or with different... Excuse me. There we go. Yeah, because it definitely looks like the lava was supposed to be raised. Let's go back. I have to go back and raise it, and then see what's going on. I'm gonna try the fast forward button. Whoa, okay. Little fast. Let's see. I'll try not to do that again too many times. I might have to go back and try that other room to get the stuff again. Going. What's going there? So, what's the point of this one? Oh. Treasure chest. Oh, there's another treasure chest. Honestly, I'm going to go back for that. Um, right now, I'm going to end the episode, and then I'm going to go back and pick up that um, blue chest in this other room, or see if I can. I just don't want to like put you guys through me going on platforms again. So, I'll be right back. See you later.